Rip currents are common on coastlines with breaking waves. When inbound waves break more strongly in some locations, circulation cells form, causing outbound rip currents to travel in narrow, fast-moving belts. As waves break over a sandbar, the water level on the landward side increases, creating a pressure gradient that drives the current along shore. Longshore currents converge and turn outward through the low water zone, at which point it becomes a rip current. Its velocity depends on the height of incoming waves and can range from 0.5 to 2.5 meters per second. Swimmers who encounter a rip current should not swim against the current. Float outbound along the current until it weakens, then swim parallel to the shore, then toward the shore along the inbound wave. 